So thank you very much for attending. Um, I'm Simone Gallas, and uh, within my research track, uh, I am uh, dealing with uh, virtual sensing techniques for joint models uh, parameter estimation. Uh, my project uh, is a Flanders Make uh, uh, project, and the name is a uh, Joint Tool, and it is in collaboration with other seven industrial partners. So we see nowadays in several uh, industrial sectors some design requirements getting more and more important. And among those, we have, uh, of course, the energy efficiency, the announcement of dynamic, of dy dynamic performances, and uh, both of them should be taken in consideration together with the um, limitation given by the cost-driven market. So to achieve those uh, design requirements, we see an industrial trend towards lightweight structures, where different kinds of materials, including uh, composites, are combined together with the, with the traditional ones. In this uh, um, multi-material framework, it is uh, really important to focus on the joining of those different parts. And then, uh, together with this new industrial trend, we have new challenges for us engineers in uh, uh, controlling, monitoring, and analyzing those mechanical joints. Then uh, the typical approach for us engineers to uh, deal with new challenges is the modeling. And particularly in this case, when we have at the same time to consider the complex assembly together with uh, the local joining technologies, uh, it is really important to take a decision in between modeling those joints in a, using complex models that are of course accurate, but they are requiring long computational times and long modeling times, uh, or using conceptual models that are simple with a, a cost of a lower accuracy though. Uh, in my, within my research track, I am um, choosing the second option, so I am choosing the concept models, and in order to uh, use them uh, to have uh, anyway a reliable and accurate uh, means to, to, to deal with these uh, new challenges, I upgrade them to the level of the digital twin. Um, the digital twin is a combination of model and measurements where the information coming from them are combined together and elaborated in an estimator, together with the uncertainties of uh, the model and the measurements that are um, expected. Then the estimator gives us as an output um, some virtual sensor that we can use uh, um, to have better parameter estimation of uh, our conceptual models. The, the conceptual models, it is important to be mentioned that usually uh, the, the, the physical characteristics of them are condensed together in few uh, parameters that uh, often are not directly related to the uh, reality, to the physics. And then it is really important to have a, um, an accurate parameter estimation for them in order to have a powerful uh, means to um, design and to help the, the design of those joints. Finally, we see an example of parameter estimation in which the system that uh, I am investigating is a clamped system of two plates are easily bonded together. And uh, the test rig is equipped with the four accelerometers in this case, and the signals from the accelerometers are given to an estimator. The estimator in this case is a linear common filter that gives us an output for uh, virtual sensors, in this case matching with the real ones. The parameter estimation is made possible by minimizing the error um, in between the virtual sensor and the real ones. This is only one of the different uh, potential applications of virtual sensing techniques for parameter estimation, and in the upcoming months I will be investigating further the, these powerful uh, methodologies. Thank you for the attention.